Hi everyone, this is Terry. I thought it'd be helpful to show people who happen to own a scan and cut and it can be an earlier model of a scan and cut. It doesn't have to be the newest one. And your screens may look different if you have the newer model, but I want to show you how you can take a design that you possibly scanned in from say a, a drawing or you can use one of the shapes within the, the scanning cut and then take that into the embroidery side to create an applique. So the first thing I'm going to do is to touch the screen and it wants to move the carriage. I'll go into pattern and in this case I'll use a pattern that's built in to the machine and we'll choose something that's relatively simple so let's go in and we'll choose we'll choose this little star and i'm interested in all of the star we'll see what happens but more importantly the outside of it i'll make it a little bit larger and choose OK. Now you'll notice it's two pieces, and as I said, I'm interested in part A. So I'll choose OK. And now what I want to do is I want to set this so I can save it either to the cloud or to a USB stick. So I'll do that, and I'll choose Save. Now I'll choose Save, and on my machine it says Scan and Cut Canvas. That's the same thing is saving to the cloud. I want to save it to my machine also so that I had the size of it. So we'll do that first. And you notice it's number five on the memory. Now I'll choose save and we'll go to the scan and cut canvas and it's project ending in zero two. And if you happen to want to save it to a USB stick, you can do that as well and it'll save it to the USB stick. In my case, I can't rename this, but you can see it's an FCM file. So now what we're going to do is we're going to continue this video at on my computer on PE Design 11.